Hey planner friends, it's Nia from Life with Nia. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing a couple of unboxings of hauls um, and I did not want to wait until Friday um, because it's Saturday and so that would mean like waiting a whole week and seeing what I accumulate in um, happy mail throughout the week to do the video and I want to play with my stuff now and I thought it would be fun to have a haul video for the weekend so I got two things today one from Simply Gilded one from Cloth and Paper and um, I'm going to do the cloth and paper order first I love 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 these black boxes everything out and I love their new tissue paper too it's so pretty so this was an order that is primarily pins let me get out my post-it notes to write pen test on so we have here um, a little freebie of drops and they had shared that this color is called sorbet which um, there are some other items available in this color and then um, little freebie journaling card that says I attribute my success to this I never gave or took any excuse Florence Nightingale and then I had um, this is not a freebie this is something I ordered so these are the Mademoiselle page flags and <clears throat> okay, so let's see. I also got the Dirty Chai Circle Sticky Note. So that is this. And I'm hoping this becomes available in some other colors, but I don't need it to because then I will be forced to buy them. And then I got the Admin Planner Pocket Folder in Rosé. Um, I have a black one, but I thought um, this would look nice in my half letter as well. So I got that. And then I got pins. And so as you can see here, I got pins. So... Some are new to me, I have not tried before, and some are um, uh, pins that I just love. And so um, they were back in stock and I wanted to take advantage of that. So the Sarasa Dry is currently my favorite. So I grabbed another one of those. And um, I like the um, Kokuyomi pins. So I already had one in Tofu White. I thought I did not. Um, so that's this is the Tofu White. And then I also got one in the Smoky Sky, which I love anything blue. And I think, honestly, the color on um, the website is a little bit misleading. It looks more green on the website. Um, but I like this pin a lot. Um, my favorite, though, is the Sarasa Dry. So this is the Kokuyomi. Yeah, I like these a lot as well. So I'm like really, um, even though I love 0.7, I'm really starting to love 0.5. And these are 0.5. So I grabbed a couple of those. I grabbed a couple of the Uni pin. These work really well on the transparent page flags and squares. Um, they're an oil-based ink marking pin. And um, I have the... 01 and the 02 and then the 03 became available and I definitely am a like I said I like 0.7 so I'm definitely prefer a more bold or thicker line and so yeah this three is like right up my alley I'm gonna need to get some more of these um, so I grabbed two of those happy happy and then these are new to me. So these were put back in stock and they were relatively inexpensive. I want to say it was like $1.70 or $1.90 a pin. Plus I had a discount. 
Um, so these are the Sarasa clip and they're all 0.5 millimeter. I got the blue black, the milk green, the gray and the brown. And I believe that they also write in their color. So this is gray and yes, it writes in gray. Let's see, you gotta take the little thing off the tip. This one is brown and I'm not sure I got all that off of there, which I didn't because it's brown with red. So I'll have to get that off of there. It's difficult to get off. This is the milk green. And I can't get it off of here either. So milk green. And then the blue black. So cool. I the white one fell out of my cart, but I wanted to have a white one to write on my black sticky notes, and um, I just took a little too long to put my order in. So that is my cloth and paper haul. Loving these goodies as always. I'm going to sit all that aside. And then I also picked up um, the Simply Gilded this was the um, purple release. So um I think if you spent 50 you got a free um, reusable bag so that's what this is and it's a cute little square when it's all folded up so it will fit nicely into something and oh, it's really pretty pretty like rainbow color so that was included with my order. It's got handles. And like I said, it folds up and tucks away very nicely. So, and it says simply gilded here on the back. So that was included with my order. And let's get into this purple washi. So here are my freebies. A little um, bow seal and a sticker sheet and journaling card with the purple, whoops, purple floral. So those are my freebie goodies. Okay, and then also, I think all orders on the release day um, received a free roll of washi tape. So this is the free roll of washi. It's like a light purple lavender color and it's got different gemstones on it with like a silver foil. And I don't know what the name of it would be. Um, it doesn't say, but very cute. All right. So what I ordered is, this is the Y'all know I always struggle with these names. I believe this is Purple Rain with the light gold bow. I don't know. I might come across something else that seems to fit that description. But I think this is Purple Rain. So um, we've got the gold bows there. And this is, to me, was the only true purple, deep purple color. Alright, get the noisemaker out the way. Okay, so this is <laughs> y'all, I don't know what these are. 
Okay, let's try this. Marshmallow Mint. And it has a black bow. And Princess Purple. Oops. Which also has a black bow. I did not get the pink one. I feel like I have enough pink washi and pink is not by any means my favorite color. So I grabbed the purple and the mint. So Princess Purple Marshmallow Mint. Um, then I grabbed the Stardust. So this is Lilac Sunrise Stardust. And um, it has silver with silver sparkler hollow foil. And I believe there were different variations. So this is the variation that I got. And I just always love Stardust. So can't go wrong there. And then I grabbed the um, perforated 10 millimeter light lavender tass with silver sparkler hollow. So... I don't know if the, the sparkler hollow picks up, but it's really pretty. And I love the Task Washi. So got that. Then I got the a Variation Ombre Purple Passion with Silver Sparkler Hollow Bow. And um, again, this is the variation that I got. I think that's pretty. A little, little bit of pink in there, but... Um, that hollow is really pretty. So I grabbed that. All right, so I've got three left. A thistle, sweet iris, and rock candy. I don't know which is which. Um, so we have three here, but I don't know which one is which. So it's Thistle with Silver Sparkler Hollow, Sweet Iris with Silver Sparkler Hollow, and Rock Candy. Um, but I, like I said, I can't tell you which is which. Um, I, I'm going to need to figure it out, though, because I want to put these down in my new little um, book of washi. They're all very pretty, and they are all just slightly different shades of purple. It was really hard to tell from the pictures and online. They looked more pink, but um, this is this one's more of a periwinkle in my opinion. But and I think the middle is more of like a lavender. But they're all very pretty. So that is my simply gilded haul. Um, you. If you watch my videos, you know that this month I'm on a no spin. I'll be breaking it on Tuesday. Actually, I already broke it. I broke it yesterday with cloth and paper because the sticker books were back in stock. So I got in and got out. Um, but I'll be breaking it again on Tuesday because I was like, oh, I don't want the celestial stuff. That's cool. But then I saw the Midnight Rose gold one and I was like, okay, I need the celestial stuff. <laughs> It's rough out here in these planner streets having a no spend. It's rough, but I love all my things and I play with them. So there's that. Thanks for joining me for this little mini haul. That's my goodies for the weekend from Cloth and Paper and Simply Gilded. Um, so I am going to organize and put all of my goodies together and I will see you next time. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for being a part of my community. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.